today we are talking how a we're talking striking digital transformation. Uh, in 2019, we had come to the end of our life cycle around ITSM. We needed to refresh. And we had three drivers in this effort. So the first was we needed to deploy quickly. In our previous deployment and our major upgrades, it taken 12 to 18 months. Uh, over time, we've done a fair amount of customization and that led to a high degree of technical debt. It made it more expensive to support. So we wanted to get much simpler. And finally, we have a drive to delight our customers. So we wanted a system that's much more customer focused. But ideally speaking, when, when we heard what they were trying to accomplish, it definitely presented a, a really, I guess you'd say, a large scale challenge. We needed to take a look. We need to do something different. We, as a corporation, has an effort underway to really make a digital transformation. So we needed a system that fit that. One of the primary drivers for selecting ServiceNow was the modular capability built within the Now platform. ServiceNow is integrated. It simplifies the support. Um, and it's built from a customer point of view. Don, one of the first things that you said at the start is that one of our kind of measures is that we wanted to have a delightful user experience. So we were kind of looking at an am more of an Amazon type model where it's all based on what makes life easy for the user. If we were truly going to shift mindsets of how the group using ServiceNow interface with customers and made it delightful, it's not just about the, the, the user interface. Better if we manage expectations and let people in there, it's better to get them in there and get their feedback and, and, and be a part of the solution. If we want to pull in seven months, we can't do it the way we've always done. So let's give it a chance. You know, let's take a leap of faith. Let's do it the KPMG way. 